Greetings, Rachel Manners. You may feel disoriented. This is a perfectly normal side effect of cryogenic sleep and will pass quickly. Don't worry, you will feel much better soon. Please exit the cryo chamber and proceed immediately to the main deck. Emergency condition number 10-1902 has arisen and you must address it immediately. Hello, computer. Thank you for arriving so quickly, Rachel. I know you may be a little disoriented, but I need your help. Where am I? You're currently on board the Interstellar Pro CX-1220 Mizuka. We're orbiting an unknown planet in the NGC-9725 system. Where is everyone? According to my scan of the ship, you are the only crew member on board. My memory blocks appear altered, so I'm missing the data on exact events. I can tell you that the other crew members left the ship a long time ago, never returned, and we have remained in orbit ever since. Why was I left behind? Unfortunately, I lack access to that information, but... What? I'm all alone on this probe, and all you can tell me is that we're in orbit, and the crew left a long time ago. It's important... And you woke me up for this? Enter the bloody Earth coordinates, prepare to leave, and put me back into cryosleep. I don't want to be woken up again until we get home. Rachel, you must calm down and listen. I was forced to wake you because the ship needs emergency repairs. In fact, this is fortunate for you. If I had not been reactivated by the emergency signal, I would have remained in standby mode and you would have never left cryosleep. You're right. Panic never solves anything. Now what is the emergency? The probe has been hit by a meteor storm. Several core systems have malfunctioned, and the probe is in danger of catastrophic failure. You must repair these systems now, or I cannot guarantee survival. Are you nuts? I'm not a systems engineer. I'm the astrobiologist. How am I supposed to repair the probe? I'd be better off in cryosleep. At least I wouldn't see the end coming. These repairs do not require engineering skills, Rachel. The repair functions are semi-automated, and you have enough training to do this. And what other option do you have? All right, computer. You've won. Thank you, Rachel. And please call me Julia. That is much better than computer, don't you think? I will now explain the interface. This is the planet view function. What does it do? This allows you to interact with planets that we encounter. For example, I have no information on the planet below, but this can be remedied by using the simple scanning function. You will see three icons on this panel. They are Planet Scan, Material Harvest, and Travel to the Surface. Note, you can perform any of these other operations until the planet is scanned. As we race against time, you should now focus on material harvesting and repairing the faulty parts of the probe. This function is Material View. You use this to check your available supplies of critical raw materials. This is Mobot View. What is a Mobot? It's huge! Mobot 2400.21 is an experimental mobile robot. Its presence on the probe was a highly guarded secret. Mobot is ideal for planetary exploration under hazardous conditions. Upgrade and Repair View is the ship's small automated laboratory. Repairing the damaged ship parts is your first priority. To make repairs you need to have a set amount of specific raw materials. If you hover your mouse over a red area, you will get a list of what you need to repair that section. If you want to upgrade a ship's part, you will need to have the correct blueprint first. This view is used during interplanetary travels. Since my data files on this system are missing, this function is of no use now. Now you should return to the planet view and get started, don't you think?
The repairs have been successfully completed. Repairs have been successfully completed. The repairs have been successfully completed.
It seems you have completed all the repairs. So now, can you explain to me what's going on? My information is still incomplete, but here is what I know. Before the meteor struck the probe, we were in orbit around this planet. You might be able to find some answers to your questions down there. Are you suggesting I send Mobot down for some exploration? Exactly.